Hello subscribers and my dear students. As we know that we are going through the pandemic of COVID-19. So I request you to be safe at home and use all the precautions. Today I am back with another interesting video. Hope you learn from it. Let's start. Hello dear students and my subscribers. Today my topic of discussion is Pricing of Services when we discuss pricing of services before explanation let us start what is the meaning of price or pricing pricing is the key element in the traditional marketing mix that is four piece and also the also the enhance marketing mix the seven piece this element this pricing element earns revenue okay and this is highly critical because this strategy makes business okay now the firm must take it both ways the price in get profit for the firm and give value to the customer clear let us discuss the pricing objective okay in pricing objective the number one is survival when it comes to survival na, the farm which is not doing well which is not doing well not doing well in terms of capacity competition change in consumer requirements this is the only objective okay and the farm may cover the whole variable cost and the part of fixed cost here in the in this short term objective and uh, especially what happened is that the farm covers the variable cost and fixed cost in short term objective wherein where in the case of long term the farm may learn to add value over its services or it may face extension okay so first objective is survival the second objective is profit maximization in profit maximization the firm sets a price that will maximize its current profit without without changing 
द सर्विस एट्रीब्यूट्स दे डिटरमाइन द मार्केट डिमांड फॉर ऑल्टरनेटिव प्राइस एंड चूज द फ्लो ऑफ प्राइस वेयर द रिटर्न कैश फ्लो और करेंट प्रॉफिट इज मैक्सिमम एंड दिस इज अ मीडियम थ्रू हुई शॉर्ट टर्म मेजर्स आर टेकन एंड इफ इन द लॉन्ग टर्म द रन द फॉर्म मे नॉट डू वेल ओके दिस इज द मीडियम फॉर शॉर्ट टर्म वेयर दे डिटरमाइन द मार्केट डिमांड फॉर ऑल्टरनेटिव प्राइसेस एंड चूज द प्राइसेस वेयर द रिटर्न ऑफ कैश फ्लो एंड करेंट प्रॉफिट इज मैक्सिमम The third objective is revenue recognition. Some companies want to maximize. Some companies want to maximize their. profits by increasing the market share or by reducing the price or setting a low price they believe that this will lead to higher sales volume lower unit of cost of production and long term profit okay next of the objective is prestige here some companies like putting their putting their services in the premium category by charging in charging a high price which they think create an image of class prestige in the customer view now let us discuss the approaches to pricing services having set pricing objective the firm has to do a proper pricing for a proper pricing the firm have to think about three major structure the three major structure are cost then demand which may be on market or value and the th- number 3 is competition the firm can adopt any one or more structure with an appropriate proportion in combination okay so let us discuss the pricing so when you have cost we can frame it as or it can be go as cost based pricing as the name suggests the company find out the cost company find out the cost may be direct and indirect profit margin etc and decide the price price 
we have basic formula as we know that uh, price is equal to fixed uh, overheads we write in bracket overheads or indirect cost plus variable that is direct cost plus profit okay this cost based pricing is the simplest simple method is the most simplest method okay because the total cost is ascertained and markup added markup cost is added to it okay it is easier for goods not for as far as services okay and most importantly this knowledge of estimate may decide about the contingency amount which will make the price the most important point here is that one can decide the cost then markup then decide the cost okay of contingency amount that will make the price clear so the next pricing objective is our market oriented pricing or demand based pricing this may be also known as value based pricing okay as the name suggests the pricing is based on demand behavior of the customer that is setting prices prices consistent with customer perception of value okay prices which customer will pay for the services rendered okay and uh, under this market oriented pricing we have market scheming market scheming is offering high value or unique services by the service providers for a higher price this happen when there is no competitors and later when the competitor come the prices may be reduced okay the next one is penetration pricing this is some extent opposite to market skimming here initially the or in introduction price is kept low okay kept low so that so that it helps in 
मार्केट कैप्चर कैप्चरिंग और मार्केट पेनिट्रेशन ओके स्लोली द वैल्यू ऑफर इंक्रीजेस एंड इफ द डिमांड रिमेन द प्राइसेस कैन बी एनहेंस्ड ओके दिस इज एन एप्रोप्रिएट वेयर कंडीशन एंड केयर आर टेकन नॉट टू बी सेट एट लो प्राइस बट enhancement of the look may be unacceptable initially the price is kept low when the market is growing okay slowly the value of uh, the value of our increases and the demand remain of the price can remain enhanced okay some points need to be focused here is that sales volume of the services are sensitive sorry sensitive to the price okay secondly a service faces threats of strong potential competition soon after introduction and uh, most importantly it is possible to achieve economies in unit by operating at large volume another one under market orient Trade pricing is price discrimination. Price discrimination is also known as differential pricing. Is also known as differential pricing. This pricing is applied on some factor. The factors are place. for the customer who have sensitive to the location for example uh, cinema halls different rows and concert yes then based on time okay at different times of the day any period they may pick off hours of our internet surfing yes about quantity for the volume of purchase yes then uh, we have incentives this is given usually to the regular or more frequent user in form of incentive or discounts so this type of pricings comes under differential pricings or price discrimination and they are determined on the basis of place quantity time and incentives yes and the third one was competition based pricing this is another approach of pricing which re, which relate to the price made by the competitors that does not always mean the price to be same as competitor but the knowledge of their cost and pricing and the customer expectations act as a starting point okay this is applied in two situation when service providers are standards and oligopolies where there are few large service providers now under competition based pricing we have price signaling okay price signaling this is a common phenomenon where high where high concentration of sellers in the market 
okay and here the prices are offered by one seller is matched by the other to avoid any low price advantage to any seller example is the airline industry here what happen is the price offered by one seller okay is matched by the others to avoid low price advantage to any sellers clear the so second under competition based pricing secondly we have price matching and price matching is adopted for playing safe in the mature market by price at the same level this price matching means price at same level okay this is nearly done by taxi service or internet cafe something like that another one we have price bidding this is also known as close bid pricing as the name suggest this is a strategy mostly used by construction building services okay for sending the buyer a same price so that they get so mostly they get a, a close bid of the product and services whatever they are offering this is a normally used by the builders or the person in manufacturing services and the last one is destroyer pricing it is the setting of price at very low so that the competitor cannot match it okay the price is set without making any loss and mostly it is used for driving the competition from the market any firm adopting this strategy should be very much careful for setting the price it does not mean that they should suffer the loss okay and also if the competitor are strong enough the firm itself may be driven out of the business so destroyer pricing is also an important strategy so today we have discussed about pricing of services this is the meaning and we discuss the objective and we discuss the approaches to pricing hope you like my video thank you for watching kindly subscribe my channel tomorrow will be i am back with another video in this covid 19 be safe